with the GDP at a three-year low. A day after, SBI reports said the current economic slowdown is neither short or transient. Finance Minister Arun Jaitley today said the government will soon bring additional measures to boost the sluggish growth. He just had to consult the Prime Minister. What will these next steps be? Sunil Prabhu has the details. With growth at the lowest in three years, with industrial production sharply down, with no jobs and under attack over high fuel prices, the finance minister is promising action, but awaits a sign-off by the prime minister. We've taken uh, uh, note of all the indications which are coming and of course uh, uh, the government will uh, take any additional moves which are necessary. I'm not in a position to announce it today in the press conference. I'll certainly be consulting the Prime Minister before that. And when we decide, you'll probably come to know. So far, the government has zeroed in on a couple of goals and crisis areas, like GST and cheaper loans. But the roadmap to these goals is work in progress and still requires the Prime Minister's approval. For easier loans, banks need about 1.3 lakh crore rupees to recapitalize them after bad debts worth roughly 7 lakh crore. The options are to use the money returned after demonetization. Another way to raise more cash is divestment in government firms. But the government has already failed to meet its targets in the last three years. The basic idea is that once banks have cash to cover their bad loans, they can lend to small and medium businesses. And that will revive growth, as SMEs contribute nearly 45% to the GDP. The political leadership is determined to take urgent steps to revive economic growth. Sources say they want job creation. They are concerned with inertia in the bureaucracy. They have heard the various experts and officials and now want changes to be done as soon as possible. The other area of concern and priority which will need to be addressed, which top officials concede, is a major issue, is the GSTN network. Clearly the focus will be on setting their house in order, but that will take time given the number of massive delays and complaints that have come in from nearly 80 to 90 lakh businesses across the country. But the focus will be on the economic slowdown, on how to revive the economy, which will require a stimulus package. That requires the Prime Minister's approval and also it's not clear how soon that package will be delivered. With camera person N. Suresh Kumar, Sunil Prabhu, NDTV.